Hi everyone, uh, welcome to another installment of Quinn's Bog Ventures. Um, today this is just going to be a real short one um, because I have something in my hand that you can't see on screen right now that we're going to talk about and it's a painted turtle. It's still kind of hiding in there, but painted turtles get their name um, from the colors on their plastron and their carapace. The carapace being the top and the plastron being the bottom. And with our turtles in Minnesota, our painted turtles at least, um, they're the subspecies of western painted turtle. Throughout the U.S. there are different subspecies, different colors of painted turtles. Ours just so happens to be one of the more colorful, especially on the bottom side on the plastron of this turtle. Lots and lots of nice red and yellow and sometimes green maculations on the bottom there. And this is a fairly uh, pretty normal turtle. Not too big, not too small. This one also has a couple of neat hitchhikers on it. I was looking at the turtle as we saw it crossing the road and if we take a peek at the back legs, you can see it's got some leeches, which is not a terribly uncommon thing for a lot of turtles um, to be carrying a few leeches. There's a couple more there. An awesome little turtle. Um, if you ever do see turtles crossing the road, um, if you do want to help them across, always make sure that you take them the direction they were going. While we wait for this painted turtle to cross the road, let's consider one of the most interesting parts of their biology. After a painted turtle lays its eggs, 50 to 80 days later they will hatch. If those eggs hatch on the later end, oftentimes those young will not emerge from the nest and will overwinter underground. For us in northern Minnesota, that means dealing with extreme cold temperatures. Sort of like wood frogs, young painted turtles are well adapted to surviving extreme cold temperatures by being able to freeze almost solid before emerging the next spring, ready to go. And slowly but surely, off it goes. Thanks for watching, uh, and until next time, we'll see you in the bottom.